When it's mocha frappuccino time. Coach, 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 coach. Hold on. Hold on. One second. <clears throat> I'll update you right now on everything that's going on <clears throat> according to scripture. And many you had to um, have been there to understand. Okay, so <clears throat> I just got out of a uh, quick, short, uh, coup de gras type of two second, what we'll call a conversation with the devil regarding um, the situation. And it has been resolved. Uh, there was temporary aggression from the devil towards my team for a split second. Um, it was fine for us. Uh, first of all, I just want to say, my prophets, you are amazing. You did your job perfectly. We struck hard with precision and we, um, we harvested where we needed to harvest, you know. We got ours back and that's kind of what um, really... Well, we got sucker punched by the devil and usually that's what we expected, but we had um, been planning this for 6,000 years. You know, me being the Messiah, I was definitely trained well by big coach and he's loving this, so I'm happy. Um, the terms were broken regarding Mary Magdalene, you know. We had um, already determined about a year ago when she showed up uh, from her church riddled with demons that the devil could have the church so um, while there were a few mean looks and annoyances when we were harvesting outside the church once we started really penetrating inside the devil's church that's when um, the aggression started. But I reminded the devil that Mary Magdalene was not returned and that I had promised there would be war <clears throat> if she was not. And also that those that truly repented in their heart belonged to me and that we had no intention of messing with the devil's church at all, that I was going to continue doing what I am doing and the devil could of course have his church now the conversation was basically oh all right then late so it went <clears throat> pretty quick Mary Magdalene is in stable condition our whole entire plan was to uh, build her, her dream house and we feel that we succeeded at that what's on my window is kind of an insult towards the American church for removing God. So what you can see, you can see. But the whole plan worked out perfectly. We had our prophets in position. Our prophets were issuing the proper warnings. And um, now the American church is on its knees and it has who it chose. Um, we do not plan on any aggression towards the American church whatsoever. What our terms were basically was I'll be preaching, my people will be preaching and they'll be left alone. And that's really what that was about. We don't touch God's anointed, do my prophets no harm. It does not matter to me where it's coming from. If it's coming towards Jesus and his people, we take that as a sign of aggression and we will return fire. So me and my angels, we hit hard, we struck hard, and I feel <clears throat> this victory really belongs to the team, to Team Jesus. You know, Mary was telling us for a long time she was Team Jesus and we were watching the situation. You just wait for the right moment. Everybody does their job and it, I couldn't ask for more. I really couldn't. Um, there's three spirits <clears throat> that come out of the frog's mouth, that revelation, you know, the lying spirit, the familiar spirit, 
in the spirit of the Antichrist. And you, you have it all in the American church. So <clears throat> that's really all we wanted to do is make sure everybody could really make their decisions based on who they were truly in love with. And if they were in love with Jesus, they're on team Jesus right now. And if they're not, then they weren't. And it was that simple. You know, we drew a line. And my prophets really carried their cross. They showed the discipline that a true follower of Jesus would inevitably show. They would be themselves. Yeah. <clears throat> so. You're. Who? Right. So. <clears throat> You're claiming to be Jesus. Oh, oh, oh. Right now, my team is really um, <clears throat> focused right now on building my kingdom. And that's what we've been doing. You know, the kingdom marriages thing was really great. We're gonna continue with that. Um, the situation turned into a war, as the scripture said it would. So we had our 30 seconds of silence to make it plain. <clears throat> and we're back on schedule doing what we were supposed to do. So those that were called and answered the call, thank you. There was a reason for that. Yeah. <clears throat> um... I don't plan on teaching with authority right now. I'm playing with my people. Uh, my thoughts on it are that the real Christians are probably outside the church. Yeah. And that they just need a chance to show that they are God's people. I, I feel that um, they should have always had the chance to take this word, <clears throat> walk through it with me like I did with Big Coach, and that's what Big Coach wants to, you know, he wants a relationship. So bringing him into it, 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 it was kind of just a monumental moment we were looking for to say, hey, God is in charge of every moment of every existence ever. You know, being mocked and everything like that, there had to be some type of playful recourse. So we look at it as um, <clears throat> there are more outside that uh, truly desire God, that truly would give it 100%. And we harvested there, you know, seeds were planted. Um, we're reaching out in new effective ways. Each one of my prophets uh, using the creativity from the Holy Spirit, the Father gave us all for God's glory. And it's a great thing. It's a beautiful thing. Um, the whole purpose that we had was that we think you're amazing the way you are and that you shouldn't be shamed and that you shouldn't feel any type of uh, judgment towards you for um, being you. And that you should have the support if you have a vice or something like that, I can work with you on that. You know, I just cleaned up a whole bunch of people. You see us, we work as a team. Um, the place looks pretty much spotless. It's been so long since that happened. That's why I'm so excited about the whole uh, us doing laundry thing as a team. I would not do anything by myself. I was putting my spirit in people like we can do this. And then we got uh, an order this morning. <clears throat> we confirmed it in scripture. And we carried it out. 
And that's what it's about, being a team. You know, following orders that you get from the Holy Spirit and knowing what you're doing. You know, you got to know what you're doing. And I trained my team pretty well for that. But once the coin was stolen, then... Um, the formalities were handed out. I showed up. I said, hey... She is pure in heart. I've tested her. You can't have her by any means. There is no legal ground there. For the American church system, the devil has legal ground. So technically, the devil was kind of like, hey, did you just give me a church and now you're going to take it back? That's where the aggression started. Now, what's yours is yours. They chose you. You won fair and square. So <clears throat> my whole entire plan is to not get into that. To focus on my bride and the things that we're going to be doing. You know, the rewards, the good things. And I wasn't going to live without my reward. I worked hard for my wife. So we'll go ahead and confirm that real quick. <clears throat> Blessed, fortunate, prosperous, favored by God is he whose transgression is forgiven and whose sin is covered. Blessed is the man to whom the Lord does not impute wickedness and in whose spirit there is no deceit. You know, so those are my people. And the people that were truly mine are still truly mine. I did not lose one yet. Yeah, you. <clears throat> so you rule the world and then the American church system was a part of the dragon yeah part of the dragon's tail there's a whole thing that caused the angels to fall but huge part was that and it's been dealt with you know um, we're not gonna be uh, at war anymore regarding really I had promised no more war no more death and we're in a good place so that's the update for now I kept it short and simple big coach says it's perfect I love you welcome back to team Jesus family